Hello, I'm Diana Cabrera, student reporter for No 99 Television. I'm here at Fred Borman Elementary School where the students are learning the latest technology for disease detection. Yeah, that looks pretty good. It's kind of disappearing now, but you can still see them there, right? Imagine if you could put a drop of your saliva on a slide, run a scientific procedure, and have the results tell you why you're sick. Well, Alicia Porter from the Arizona Science Center explains that will happen soon. She's showing these students how this experiment works in a fun way that gets them excited about learning more about science and the ways it can be used to prevent diseases. Finding diseases in a really quick way is very important for us to be able to do in this day and age, and that's what the kids were trying out with the sensor array. The sensor array is the heart of the experiment. It's a small glass slide where the saliva goes. The slide is full of sensors. It reacts with the saliva, and small ducts appear. The patterns these ducts make indicate a disease. It lights up all of the places where the antibodies have stuck to the sensor array. And then from that, we end up with a special pattern on our sensor array. It's really important that students are introduced to this world of science so that they can contribute to it in the future. Quiero ser científica. Porque puedes hacer muchos proyectos y pues ayudas a los niños que aprendan más. This exercise shows students that science can be applied to everyday life. When they leave these classrooms today, they can think about whether they want to make a career out of it or just learn this new process of finding diseases. Reporting for No 99 Television and Diana Cabrera.